Breaking news. A Doe State Governor, Godwin Obaseki, says it does not make sense to pass anti-open grazing law without enforcing it. Governor Godwin Obaseki, we welcome you. It is your fault if it is not enforced. By the way, in the Southwest, yes, because every one of you are fighting, are looking for a way to chicken out and not stand up to responsibility and speak for your people. The Southwest governors came together to form what we call anti, uh, to form what we call Amutekun. In the Southwest region of the states, which comprise of six, six states, which are Ekiti, Ondo, Oshun, Ogun, Lagos, and Oyo. They have what we call Amutekun, which is enforcing the anti-open grazing law. In my knowledge, I might be wrong. Ondo State being one of the states where Amutekun is strongest. Now, who is funding Amutekun? Because they are being paid. This is what they do now. It is the governors that, has now, that is now paying their salaries. But you know what's happening in the South, South, and in the South East? They don't want to spend money. They won't keep them to their self, put them for their pocket, chop them, put them for plates, chop them. Who go enforce them for you, Buhari? Buhari will not make you put open, open grazing law in the first place. Uh -uh. Let's not deceive ourselves. If you want things, don't do it yourself. Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up, subscribe if this is your first time. Let's get all the details. Edo State Governor Godwin Obaseki said it does not make sense to pass an anti-open grazing law without enforcing it. The Edo State Governor Godwin Obaseki states this at the stakeholders' town hall meeting at the, at, on the proposed anti-open grazing law. He said that the delay in signing the anti-open grazing bill in the state follows the need to craft an implementable law that will put an end to the grazing security and economic challenges in the state. According to him, we are one of the few states that have not signed the bill into law. And the reason is simple. The law is very simple. It does not make sense to put out a law we cannot enforce. The best way of enforcing a law is to bring everybody together to be part of that law. We have a crisis in our country. It is deeply rooted. There are different causes why these are happening. Let us go to the root of the cause and resolve it there. People have said that we have lived a hundred years together in harmony before now. Why are we now having this problem today? Now, Governor Gordon Obaseki, they answer the matter. Now they ask the question. Oh. If we don't go to the reason why then we are having this problem and search, we are just scratching the surface. Let us start by understanding why we are having this challenge. To sign law is very easy. It does not make sense to put out a law that cannot be enforced. Then put people, people do your state where they not get work. Young boys and young girls, make them, form name for them. They pay their salary, now they go enforce the law. Simple and short, Obaseki. Stop using English to parabolate the matter. Do the right thing. You know, you know, in every 12th, there is a Judah. Uh, you may not be, you may not want to accept it. I'm not saying Governor God Obaseki is a Judah. That's not what I said. I just said, even Jesus Christ, hmm? Jesus Christ, the Lord, the Son of God, when he come become flesh, come come into human form, come come stay at, he gets swift. Now let swift, he get to, inside the swift, they call one Judas. You know what he Judas do now, you know what he mean now. So let's continue. The anti-grazing law, in my view, is to deal with some perspective, and perspective on this matter. I just want to tell you that this is not an issue between Christians and Muslims. It is not an issue between the North and South. It is an issue between Edo and the Fulani people. As long as we have decided that we will eat meat and drink milk, we will now have to sit down and rearrange the business on how we get the people who are producing this meat and milk and must organize themselves, how they must organize and compose themselves in our state. Let us not play politics with this issue. Let us deal with the issue honestly and openly. There are security implementations because some people have not joined and are using these headers to propagate insecurity. 
my worry is that if we don't celebrate if we don't celebrate them to understand that the business in, of cattle re rearing is separate so that those who are engaged in it know that it's their personal private business they may not understand it those who are using them criminals are using them in the state to carry out insecurity and missing the point every one of us have got to make the headers understand so basaki is giving a soft pillow to fulani headsmen in his opinion uh, people are not understanding the Fulani headsmen. They are the one producing the meat and milk. So, Edo uh, people, you must understand it. You must accept them and you must do the right thing. Yes? So, in Obaseki's own opinion, uh, what is happening, there is no need for it. Mm, there is no need for it. Because the people have to rise up to the occasion and must say it as it is and must call a spade a spade. The real issue here, the real bone for contention is that the people are tired of what is happening and like the governors of the southeast, south, south and southwest called the southern governors have agreed is that they should ban open grazing. So if they want to ban open grazing, there must be a way to implement the ban. Now implementing the ban, the southwest governors, like I earlier reiterated, are putting things in place to ensure this happens. Obaseki, spend money to implement the ban. Okay, spend money. Now the cow they give you the milk where you they drink. Not be not be cow milk, not be you they drink. Now the cow, now fresh cow milk that they can't squeeze, give you may you drink. Unless there is something more to it too, that they are not telling us. Or Baseki is not saying. I understand there's no need to pass a law that cannot be implemented. Agreed. I'm not disagreeing that part with you. The enforcement is your duty as the commander-in-chief of Edo State. So that means you never agreed with the governors before when they had the meeting. Anyway, my people, they say, where well, rain fall. Everybody go see the ground. Though. The ground After a while, the ground go open mouth. go swallow the water. The water, the water plenty rich. The ground has got in capacity. Now we go make her to, drug, to drink the water. Anyway, my people, now so the matter, they hit us. Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up, like us, share, subscribe. Click on the notification button so you can get all our latest news. God bless. Bye for now. Bye.